Uh, what's up folks, uh, welcome back, I'm Daily Fix, and yes, also here I'm, um, I'm actually testing out my camera and this um, NVIDIA broadcasting thing as well, I'm recording it for every video for this week. Let me know in the comment section if you like it. This is actually recorded live from Twitch, so there might be some interaction with a window that's on the side there. If there is, I'll always try to read what has been said, because I just don't want to litter my entire screen with everything you can see. Now, we are currently, I'm just hoping for the Bajem event, in all honesty, and I'm actually considering building another of these. It is not having orders right now, which I think is always a mistake. So let's build those mining and that research station. And considering they're not attempting to get Alpha Centauri, it's not the best planet, but it does have food plus 10, which is, you know, quite helpful. Especially because my food is uh, running a bit low. The NX class, nothing they can do for us currently. But we can actually help it research. So sending you off. Maybe we should try to find all of the empires over here. So let's go survey with the, uh, with the Enterprise. Give it a bit of a mission. All the way over there, there, and just just go somewhere. Doesn't really matter. We'll find new aliens quite quite soon. And yeah, also huge shout out to the Discord community. They've been helping me hopefully well with my uh, mic settings. Um, let me know if you how do you how do you feel about the mic settings currently? How it is uh, running and all. And let us unpause and let's get going. Ooh, what the hell is this? Encounters of, uh, in, uh, 83 Lithonius. Um, first contact, nice, cool, I like that. I really enjoy this first contact stuff, like this. And, uh, uh, the Ferengi. I don't like the Ferengi, dude. I'm very, actually, well, well, I don't like is a bit of a thing, but... You know, they're, they're, they're okay. We're also improving relations and building up a spy network with the Andorians. Hopefully that will do something for us. Let's it take is a look. always good to have allies or enemies. Like, we have 10. I'm, I'm not sure how this actually works. But we need to have it done 20 or higher. Get an information. Hmm. What I would like to do is see if, there, if there's a way for us to change their ways. And I don't think that's actually possible. We'll, we'll, we'll see about that. Um, maybe gather information is not... It also costs me energy? Oh, come on. Well, you know what? We're going to use this guy to actually get to know other empires because by the end of the day, that is what is most important. Um, can I... Oh, I can't move you. Oh, wow, I can't move you for 152 days. That is... That is annoying. Uh, we're building a light cruiser by the looks of it. That is nice. And the scrolls. Oh. Um, okay, let's pause here. So, rogue elements with the Endoran military structure have taken it upon themselves to strike at Tala to force the return of the caller. I thought I brought these back. Apparently we didn't. That is worrying indeed. Uh, leader cost negative 20 and educational reforms is quite nice. Uh, Bunker networks. Uh, anything that will bring me closer to, like, shields. Ooh, this is so okay. Definitely don't want to skip this. Naval Supply Depot and the Naval Logistics Center are very, very good to have. So let's go for that. Uh, research is going well. And we are close at finishing another alloy factory. And colonization, which is definitely good as well. Once you are done... We are going to send you, like, over here to build a star post. So, send you over there. I'm um, holding shift so we can actually move you. And we'll continue. Let's see. So, ship is being constructed. The light cruiser. Okay, nice. That's going to be the first one. And hopefully, we'll soon be building an NX class ship. Uh, we could just sell oh there we go oh, finally oh i was very worried about this uh but let's just i oh, will save up on that so the embassy bonding this is the the pajam thing 
it will lead towards the pajam thing, I believe, or, or like the um, the change of ways for the Vulcans, and that will actually start getting into that federation of planet things. So uh, the United Earth Embassy on Vulcans has been uh, on Vulcan has been targeted by a successful terrorist attack. Several hundred hundreds of uh, humans and Vulcans casualties have been reported. Domestic violence is almost unheard of the Vulcan or on Vulcan, and no groups have yet claimed responsibility. However, many of the Vulcan intelligence services believe that the bombing is the work of the Serenite movement, a group dissatisfied uh, with the Delvok administration foreign policy. Um, we will uh, appro uh, we'll definitely go there, and I'm thinking a smart thing to do is just send the Enterprise. I think that's the best way to go. Uh, let's move over there. I'm sure we'll, they will be calling us in shortly, right? Uh, I believe it works like that. We also have the Universal Translator. 25 months. Damn, that's long. That is really, really long. That's going on. That's going on. This is also going on. And we still need excavation. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep the Enterprise short, actually. We're just close to home and see what will happen. Embassy bombing. So, let's pause. Why doesn't it not pause? Stop, please. Stop. Uh, okay. Well, they fended off the um, the Andorians. So, the embassy bomb. The Vulcan High Command has formally approved Earth's request to dispatch a team of experts to investigate the recent embassy bombing on Vulcan. Which is a good thing, because... This guy is going to research that. And we are going to go with shields. Yes, more shields. Go for it. Uh, luckily, it only takes like 20 months, which is not that long. And do we have anyone? Well, we don't need to improve right now. So can we move you? I say yes, we can. And stage two contacting we'll have to wait for that we'll have to wait for that and we have a time project we're losing xp which is no problem yet and let's just go let's go with the flow let's get the uh, the enterprise over there and there is demons what started as a simple inquiry upon um into an upsurge of violence against aliens living and working on Earth has quickly grown beyond the uh, confines of the criminal investigation. Earth signed uh, security has identif uh, identified a number of uh, com uh, a number of, of commonalities. Wow, that's a difficult word for me. Uh, linking the ident. Okay, so we will be doing yet more investigation. I'm not going to read all of that because I'm making a complete fool of myself. Like always. Um, this is growing. Do we now have the... No, it's still building. Damn, that takes forever. It takes so long. There we go. Um, 865. Can we get more alloys? Mm, we could sell some lafnum. Well, we're not really using it for anything else. And sell some of this as well. There we go. We should almost be able to reinforce this fleet with an Annex class. And first contact event is now pending. Which is, of course, the Federa the Ferengi Alliance, which we... Uh, well, we, they, we, we share. We definitely share some... Um, some similarities. He's over there. Who are you? The Orion Syndicate, really? Are you at Speak war? Speak boldly. Or not at all. No, you're not at war. Interesting. Okay, this one can go. Let's remove that. And let's continue. So, are you on your way back? This sign ship not doing anything. That's a mistake. That is all... All surveyed. Where do we want to send you? Could send you over here where we go, like, towards the... Kardashians. Man, it's been such a long time since I actually looked into this. Uh, we'll survey... The route the Enterprise was going to take, but now it's going to be just as similar. This this one, one scientist, and we'll just wait until how much? Oh, that's just just one more month, one more month, and we can actually go for it. Um, like 
I will agree on the... Yes. So don't waste mine. <laughs> I will definitely agree on the embassy. Where are you? What are you doing? The Zindi Sewer. Interesting. Anything over here? No, I think I want you back. Or well, we can actually look for the... The Cardassians. Wow, I'm struggling. Yeah, we'll go down here. Eventually, once we get the auto-surveying that we don't... We just the auto... Yeah, auto-surveying. Auto, auto -surveying. We don't have to do this anymore because this takes too long. We need to get into the story. That's way better. Let's take a look here. Starbase 2 is going to be done. We have a starship lost. It's a disaster. Well, that's... That's... Why? <laughs> oh no, not not the Franklin. It's my first ship. And we have the Space Ottoman. And we'll keep going. Did the Enterprise arrive yet? No, it's two more jumps. And the time project will go in... Wow, we have a murder investigation? Let's see, where is that? Is that is that all over here? No way. That's that is something. Can't use you. Can't use you. Okay, interesting. Uh survey over here. We can also find like the Klingons. They're, they're not over here, this is where the Romulans are. The Klingons are over in this patch. Interesting. Let's go with that. I don't want to read all of it. Embassy bombing over there. Yeah, I don't know where the murder actually took place. So that's going to be difficult. And we have a new colony. That is so cool. Um. Okay, interesting. So this is just where the Star Trek Beyond happened. Uh, this scientist is not doing anything. Why is that? Because we were actually doing... Wait a minute. Why can I not do this? Oh, we need a general and a trans... Oh, damn. Like 60 days? Oof. Oh, I'm not going to make that. Um... Why can I not recruit? Interesting. Why can I not recruit troops? This is new. Oh, I'm an idiot. Of course I can recruit troops. It's over there. Yeah, we're not going to be in time with this. Damn, I completely missed that. Oh, no, it's not counting down. Ooh, that is... Very fortunate. Yeah, thank, thanks, Shadow. Oh, I actually just, just saw it. I feel like a dumbass. Um, let's go to the Sol and let's assist research. It's been a few... Uh, it's been a week <laughs> since I've played. So, yeah, I'm very, very rusty. Okay, so the, um, the Enterprise actually made it towards Vulcan. That's good. And you are heading there. So, the Embassy bombing. Um... After several days analyzing the role of the embassy building and questioning identified uh, witnesses, Jonathan Archer has concluded that the evidence does indeed point towards the Serenites as the perpetrations, as the perpetrators of this of the bombing. So let's continue the investigation. Hopefully, he won't die because that's actually a possibility. I'm losing so many science ships. It feels like that at least. Uh, do I have another... Hmm... Reinforce that fleet. And I want you to return home. I wonder who these guys are going to be. Let's remove that. And uh, we're actually losing one energy, so we will have to fix that. Encounters. And we have shields. Yes. Finally. Oh, that is so good. I'm so happy about that, actually. Um, been meaning to get shields. 
let us get the what does this do teleportation replicas and germal powers i'll go with the uh, additional energy buildings let's remove those uh opus mining facility where is that okay so that is over here as well do we have that one troop okay we need to assign a general let's use this guy research that project please and there we go we have the um the nx01 enterprise refit uh which is quite expensive 350 alloys I do want to do this. I don't want to delay it. And we also have the forge, which does bring us towards um, the following part in the Vulcan thing. Let us see if we can actually manage to get more alloys. Mm. Almost. There we go. So let us continue with the refit. And after taking shelter from an electrical sandstorm with a passing Vulcan pilgrim, Jonathan Archer has made a remarkable discovery. While referring to himself initially as ever, uh, RF, the pilgrim is in fact Saren, the leader of the Saren movement, which is so cool. What a coincidence. Um, which is cool. Actually, there was something on Earth going on. Universal Translator. Uh, oh yeah, the refit. Research time, five days. Well, that happens once we actually get the Enterprise back. Unless it blows up. Which would be... Oh, no. No, 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 no. Did I just saw that the Orions got himself? Oh, that's... That's not good. That is really annoying. Oh, well, it is what it is. We can't fix it anyways. Not right now. Uh, we still need to get these two planets for ourselves. And there's the forge again. Shortly after arriving to the sanctuary, Jonathan Archer meets up with a number of Serenites who, together with the Seren, attempt to explain the nature of their movement and how it rejects violence. A young woman named the Pau is um, particularly vocal to her defense of the movement. The debate is interrupted by alarms and sounds of explosions. Looking to the sky, several Vulcan fighters can be seen laying waste to the ground beneath them. So, we are being attacked. Which is not very cool. I don't like that. I don't like to be attacked. Not even by the Vulcans. And you are going to be building the outpost once we have enough, enough alloy. So, there's the supply depot as well as the logistical center and we should go with habitability plus five demons earth security forces have swept through the operation mining facility hunting of evidence connecting to the facility to anti-alien violence so this is uh, there's definitely something over there it's worrying transport fleet one is still going i commands being manipulated into a war with the endorians I, I i definitely agree that's why we want to change the ways of the Vulcans. Jonathan Archer has experienced a number of visions following to the attack on the Serenite base. Learning the Serenites carrying the uh, Katra of Saul of, Sur of Surak now transfer, uh, uh, transfer, transferred to himself. Okay, once again. Learning that Seren carried the Katra of uh, or Saul of Surak now transfers himself the dimensional thing. Hey, thank you so much for the host, uh, Anizera. How are you doing, man? Really appreciate that. The power field, the under underpinning, um, reveals the underpinning of the Serenite's faith is the Kersha, uh, Kershara, an ancient artifact said to contain the complete writing of Surik. Oh, dear Lord, no. How are you doing, Zero? Hey, good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well. Uh, did you have fun streaming? No shared command. No, because this is a host. This is a host. It doesn't do it with everyone. So let's just go with Starbase influence cost. And we're just going to be finishing then these two. 
and you should now be able to build this outpost a bit less expensive and we want to do take this as well and i think we want to keep it that way uh, we don't need to take all of that oh wow that is a demon okay so this is a choice guys um, got a John and Paxton, the former administration of the Orpheus Station, has emerged from hiding in a dramatic fashion on Mars. Uh, having taken control of planetary broadcast facilities, oh dear, a revolt against Earth. Oof. Yeah, he is. Um, Zero is definitely, he's been with me from the start. Very much appreciated, Zero, for the host. Okay, what are we going to do, guys? Are we going to be negotiating, or are we going to send in the trips? Um, uh, true. Yeah, I agree. Let's send those guys in. Okay, so that is all out. Uh, we'll see how uh, how poorly this will go with the troops options. And there it is. We have the um, the Kishara. Uh, with the Sakura of Shurik in his mind, Jonathan Archer is able to locate the underground monastery where the Kishara has been kept safely for centuries. A small elong elongated pyramid with a Vulcan riding and song, um, alongside its faces. Well, my reading is definitely not good today, which uh, is is interesting. Um, the Keshara shows evidence of the of containing advanced storage and displaying technologies. We are going to be taking it towards the capital. Oh, what happened? Oh, uh, apparently he posted too much. It, within a second. Oh, it was a link. Okay, um, I'm sorry for that, mate. That's the that's uh, that's the bot. I can't fix that. So hopefully we will see that the Vulcans will change their way, and if they do, we will grow this coalition quite nicely. Okay, you are not doing anything. Uh, I think we're just going to bring you over here. So let's go with survey. And do it like that. Uh, I'm not sure what you posted, man. I can't see it. So, let's continue. Transport is doing nothing. And there we go. We have um, the journey from the Vulcan Forge into the capital is long and arduous. But Jonathan Archer and Tapau eventually arrived at the city outskirts. Finding shelter with the Serenite Sympathizer. A pair carefully planned their next move to confront the council. And the demon state... And Demon State? Demonstrate. <laughs> oh, yeah, demonstrate the uh, their innocence. So here we go. Hopefully it's going to go in well. We'll just see. Uh, but I'm, I'm very hopefully this is going to end well. Just cross those fingers, guys. They're planning a... Way their plan a success. The Pow and Jonathan Archer have, interf infiltra have infiltrated the council chambers of the Vulcan High Command and forced those presents to bear witness of the Kershara and the Serenites' claims of their innocence. While many were awed by the presence of the Kershara, Administrator Delvrock reacted with uncharacteristic. Un uncharacteristic? I can't pronounce it. That's fine. This is my dyslexia, which is messes up right now anger and um attempts to destroy the artifacts and kill patrol of an archer in no 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 that is not interesting jonathan archer was killed oh no this is ending poorly isn't it if it is real it isn't <gasps> they changed that changed their way but jonathan has died i think 
Oh no. So let's go with this one first. The United Earth investigation, uh, investigator John van Archer, tasked with undercovering the future of the embassy bombing on Vulcan, has been instrumental in revealing the innocence of the current movement. Um, actually, he's not that. Oh wow. This is the best. This is now they are friendly and they've changed their ways completely, which it is an honor makes it way easier to eventually ask these guys into the coalition. Let's what take a look at you. so badly, is it? They go invited into coalition. Let's confirm that. So that's going to be growing. And then uh, next up is going to be the Andorians if they agree. I'll vote yes, of course, because it's my plan. And there is the renewable energy. And we also need to do something about our fleet once that ship is built. Uh, research stations. I definitely go for that. Let's go and take a look at our ships. So, there you go. Shields on the frigates. Uh, the light cruisers as well. Still going on with that. Do we have other torpedoes yet? No, we don't. Ah, oh, that's such, such a shame. Uh, we don't have the shuttles yet. And that's why we're actually able to do this, because the power on the Enterprises is really, really horrible. Um, Auto Explorer, I don't like that. Let's flip that. And... Interesting, why do I have two? That is... Um this was auto one, so we can actually remove this one, I think. Keep it like this, the NX, and there is the flagship. Which is still using like these old torpedoes, which I don't like. Yeah, man, we're getting shields, that is so cool. I really like that. Um, the NX is now done, so we can actually send you back and research that in the... In the system of Sol, and actually retrofit. The, uh, the Enterprise. Oh, I'm so happy about this. This actually turned out really it is well. It an honor to meet you. And I need them to... Let's see, are you still rivaling them? Acceptance is a bit low, but that will eventually change. And they have indeed accepted, right? Did they refuse? Coalition invitation. So we both accept... Come on, get in here. That's three. We need one more to form, I believe. Survey has been complete. This is excellent. We get money and a lot of research. How is the planet doing? The planets are doing fine. We need another... We need to upgrade our ships to get shields, actually. So, it's not too expensive, but this will do... I believe a lot for our strength. Communication has been... And they actually did join. Look at this. That is a lot of influence. Who the hell are you? Ah, oh, man, you're ugly. Oh, the Klingons as well. And we have the, the these guys that also appear in Naruto. Let's see, so they accept it. How about Always the Endorians? Always walk cautiously under the ice. I don't want to recall that. Let's see, the Seraph Challenge movement. your preconceptions or they will challenge you. How can we see um, who are they rivaling? Zets, yes! Oh, thank you. I'm so happy someone actually knows Naruto in here. I would have made such a fool of myself. I've been re-watching Naruto, which is sad, which has been interesting. Okay, so the uh, we're definitely upgrading the ships here. I want to see what actually changed. Oh, there we go. We got shields. Finally got shields, man. It's so good. It really is good, actually. It really is. That we, it doesn't change that much because these ships are absolute trash. But we're going to be saving up our alloys. And... I think that from the uh, the next the, the first generation. Okay. The original series. I don't know them. I've... I, I've never watched the original series, to be honest. Okay, you. You can actually now have the... Logistical center. And uh, let's pause the game over here. We also need to make a third 
station. We're gonna build a lot more of them. And I want to have a station at all of my planets. Can we do this now? No, we can't. That is very awkward. Um, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed in the, on YouTube. Uh, if you want to be present with me and the others here in chat on Twitch, then there's a link in the description bringing you to my Twitch channel. And uh, just give us a follow and uh, hopefully we'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.